Hello? Let's get straight to the point, brother. In your Bible, it says, Genesis chapter 1, verse number 16. Why well, you are jumping to my Bible? Brother, don't interrupt me. First, God don't call me brother. I'm not your brother. In the Quran says, the Muslims do not call non-Muslims brother, otherwise they are kuffar. Are you one of us or you are for one from the Muslims? Okay, you're donkey then. No, God listen, no, no, listen, listen, listen. Why don't change topic? Are you? And don't talk about donkey. You're a prophet. He married Zainab ibn to Jahsh, the daughter of the donkey. Is that correct or no? Why are you afraid to talk about the scientific errors? Of the, the, the topic is, we, we never say the Bible is scientific. We never say that. It is you who say uh, that. Put, it's you, it's you. you. Like, so now look I what you are doing. Look what you are doing. You are, right so uh, do you accept that the Quran? Okay, I will go with you to the Bible. If you accept that the Quran, if you accept that the Quran is a full of a stupid mistake, do you agree? Let's go through the Bible then. We'll we will go, go to the Bible, no problem. But do you accept, because this is the topic, you are changing the topic now. I will go with oh. you only if you accept that the Quran is a stupid book. Are you willing to say that? Well, you prove the Quran is scientifically correct after I expose your Bible. How's that? Okay, no. Because if you want to do that, we go, we go to the Quran and then you can go to the Bible. The Bible, hold on. So, look, guys, okay, I will go with you. I will go. I will go. You say what you want already. So, you are saying that your God is a stupid because the Quran says Allah agree with the Bible, which we have in our hand no okay didn't you, you didn't you just didn't you just say you want to show me a stupid mistake in the book of Genesis mm. okay can you give me the mistake okay thank you okay it says in Genesis chapter 1 verse number 16 mm. God created two lights the greater light the Sun to rule the day and lesser light the moon to rule the night how, how does that make sense please brother can, can you me? please read again slowly Genesis what Genesis verse chapter 1 verse number 16. Okay, Genesis, let us go there. And you promised me we would go back to the Quran, we'll correct? Back, but... A promise of a man, right? Oh, come on, well, I'll go back. Man. A I'll promise of a man, correct? You'll give me a promise of a, a promise man. Of man. Huh? A promise of a man. Okay, yes. so Genesis chapter, chapter 1. Correct? Yeah. Okay, verse not what? Again? Number 16, brother. Okay, guys. I mean, in Genesis number 1, verse number 16, there's a mistake. What is the mistake? Go ahead. Okay, it says God created two lights. Okay. The greater light, the sun to rule the day, and the lesser light to the moon to rule the night. Okay. But today we know the sun have its own light, but the light of the moon is reflected the light from the sun. But Bible saying the moon has its own light. Why? Okay, let us see if this is true or not. In the Bible, Jesus says, when the sun disappeared, the moon will be blackened, which means the moon obviously taking the sun from its light from the sun. Secondly, as long as you agree that this is a mistake, according to your understanding, that's when your prophet... Um, made... Hold on, hold on. Let me have... oh, did, did you ask me... Did you, did, my friend, did you, did you ask me the question I'm answering? Is it me to answer now? No, so of course, your turn. Right? Okay. Did your God, Allah, created two light? <laughs> did your God, Allah, created two light? Or one light? Bro, why are you going straight back to Quran? I'm asking. No, no, no. We are answering. We are answering. You see, I have, I have the right to answer in the way I want. So either this is a mistake, and then your your prophet will be busted. So look what you just did. Look at what you just did. The, what the Bible is saying that God He created two source of light for us, and those source one nowhere it says it's taking light by itself. It says light for us. There's light. The moon brings light to us. It's reflection. Doesn't matter. Still, it's a source of light. So in daytime. We don't have, we don't see it because the sun is there, but in nighttime, still it's a source of light because it's reflection. Doesn't matter. This is nowhere it says that the Bible says that the, the moon produced its own light. In the same time, I'm asking you now, what your prophet says about the moonlight? I'm asking you. What was that, sorry, man? I'm saying what your Quran says about the moonlight. What does it say? Can you explain to me? I'm asking you, what do you know about um, your Quran? Do you know anything about the Quran moonlight? No, tell me. Why you don't know? How come you know about the Quran, about the Bible, but you don't know about your Quran? Because I don't know which one you're talking about. Okay. So guys, he said that the mistake is, it says uh, light, correct? The, the, the moon provide light, correct? Did you agree? Yes. Okay. We go to chapter 10, verse number 5. It says the same but in a horrible way. Read with me carefully. I'm reading with you, brother. It is he who made to you, the made the sun, to be shining glory and the moon to be light. Do you see it? Where is this? Uh, chapter your, 10, verse, chapter 10, verse number 5. Is that on your YouTube? Yes. You can open your Quran from your side. doesn't matter. 
so good right now. Okay. Oh, yes, I got it. All right. Okay, read for me again. You read it. Your English is better than mine, as you know. Okay. English, my English is funny. Ah, I like your English, man. It's good. Hmm. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> it is he who made the sun to be shining glory and the moon to be light of beauty mm -hmm. and measured out stages for her. Okay, he let us stop here. The rest is not that important. So now, uh, is the moon light? Is the moon light? Some? Is the moon light? No. But the Quran says the moon is light. It's a reflection of the sun. What well, it says that? It says, read carefully. This is the translation, not my translation. I'm not translating. I'm just showing you what the verse is saying. I do not even need to read it in English. I have it in Arabic. So it says it clearly. It is he who made the sun to be shining glory and the moon to be a light. Of beauty, my brother. But this is between two brackets. It's not in the Quran. This is just additional Muslim. They added adding things to the fool. No problem. Of a beauty. Hey, light of a beauty, guys. It's light. Are you happy now? Guys, it's a light of a beauty. It's a makeup. Okay, now. So now, is the is the moon is a light? I guess so, and if the Quran says so. It's... Ah, a second ago, you said no. <laughs> Do you see the hypocrisy? <laughs> a second ago, you said no. This is a mistake. Now it is, it is okay. <laughs> <laughs> Next one. Can I no, 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 no. Hold on, hold on. What do you mean next one? So are you agreeing now that your prophet is a, is a dumb and he is a stupid or what? No, don't be silly now, CP. CP. No, 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 I'm not being silly. It is you who say this is a mistake. It is you who say that the moon is not a light and does have a light. Here it says the moon itself is a light. Not only it's a provide a light, it is a light. You're taking out of context. I'm not. This is your translation. Read carefully and I can read for you in Arabic. Here we go. It okay. says, So don't tell me I'm making things up and this is your Islamic translation. It is he who made the sun to be a shining glory hmm. and the moon to be a light. Okay, is the moon a light? Hmm. You said no. No, but it's clearly talking you... about the sun. Okay, okay, give me the context of it. You said I'm taking it out of context. Give me the context. Go ahead. <laughs> Brother, it literally it's the other... <laughs> I'm not sure. <laughs> Let me ask you, is Allah a light? Huh? Is Allah a light? Allah is whatever he, he wants to be. This is not the question. Is Allah a light? He is. I'm telling you the answer. No, this if is not the answer. To... I, I have a specific... I'm not asking you if he's a zucchini. <laughs> I'm not asking you if he's a zucchini. I'm asking, is he a light? Either you say he's a light or you say he's not. Okay, he's a light. Okay. And the moon is light. What do you mean? Well, is, if Allah is a light and the moon is a light, that's mean Allah is the moon. No, that makes no sense, brother. What do you I mean? Have okay, hold on. It says here, and, and the moon to be the a light. You are fool. Huh? No, man. I have a lamp in my room. Doesn't mean it's Allah, man. Come on. This is, not no, a, this, this, this is a religion now. Don't talk about your room. Okay, come on. You know? Now, I'm asking you. This is a religion. We are serious. Are you a man or a, or a kid? I'm talking to you as a man. So... The, the Quran says the moon is a light. The Quran says too that Allah is a light. Is Allah the moon? He hang up. Mr. Mustafa Jabbar. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Ta 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 ta. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Ta da da da. Oh, he's so excited. I want to show you mistakes in the Bible. He think, oh, let me show you the first one. <laughs> this is the first victim of the day. Who's next? Brother Sitter, in the book of the Nithith, I'm going to show you a mistake in the Quran, in the Bible. This, this is exactly what stupid did that he did. But because did that, he was speaking to people who do not know the stupid Quran and the stupid Hadith and the stupid statement of Muhammad. This is how we got you busted. Nobody can debate me. Nobody. And when I say nobody, I mean it and I prove it. My microphone is open for anybody. When I say nobody, I mean it. Who wanna, bro who wanna prove me wrong? Huh? Who is a Muslim and prove me wrong? Stupidity is amazing. 